Hey y'all, Farmer Dre back at it today. Today I'm gonna give you guys a little uh, tomato update on our tomato plants. The ones that I sowed just a week ago and the ones that we have in the greenhouse here. I'm gonna go ahead and give you guys an update. So stay tuned and it's gonna be good. So I'm in here in the greenhouse. It's about 30 or 40 degrees outside, about 35 degrees outside. But in the greenhouse it is currently about 70 degrees and you guys can tell the tomato plants are looking great they are uh, they're enjoying the heat in here we have to air them out every night we cover them up we got our sawdust wood stove over there then we got our little um this little space here just in case that sawdust stove doesn't do any, do much good but it's so far so good they've been working great they're the tomato plants in about a week we're going to move them inside our big high tunnel i'm going to show you guys real quick over there but as you guys can see here, I got some uh, fruiting buds on the tomato plant. So that's good news for us. They're starting to get past that third leaf stage and um, going to start becoming in the reproductive stage. So as the tomato plants are growing, they're growing good. It's nice and warm. They love the heat. we got to water some over here looking a little dry, but there's some bigger ones, smaller ones through there. But they've been growing good. They've been enjoying the oxygen levels in here. High oxygen levels equals good growth. So I'm really excited for these tomatoes. They've been doing good. And, you know, we're hoping to have first tomatoes about the 1st of May. I'm going to go ahead and show you guys this um, our big high tunnel here. This is our small greenhouse here. It's a 20 by 30, 600 square feet. And then we have our big high tunnel. This high tunnel here is a 30 by 96. It's a nice, big, fancy, fancy one. We built it in the fall of 2017. We used it for the summer of 2018. I picked over 5,000 pounds of tomatoes out of here. I grew three varieties. I did a test trial, and uh, they did pretty good. But this year, I'm only going to do two varieties. Like I said in the previous video, just the Red Deuce and the Carolina Gold. So in here, we're going to go ahead and um, dig trenches underneath each row, which I do the rows at every four feet. Dig trenches about foot in the ground, pull some uh, pie, uh we're going to put hot water lines so it can warm up the soil because um, soil temperature is a lot more critical than air temperature because if the soil temperature is not right to start with, you, your, your, your plants can't get that enough of the nutrients available to them. And without available nutrients, then the plants will grow right. And then we're going to, we're actually working on a, um, a double barrel wood stove on the set of the barrels. We're using propane tanks and we're going to go ahead and set that right here once we're done. We're actually welding on that, that today. And uh, we're going to get that done. And I like to have the tomatoes planted, those tomatoes you guys just saw in the greenhouse, in this high tunnel here before the 1st of March. That's our goal. We are in zone 6B here. So our last frost-free date is about the third week of April. And, um, you know, it's early. We're pushing early tomatoes. But that's as a farmer, that's what you really want because that's where all the money is. And reality, every farmer farms because they love it. And they got to pay their bills somehow. So... So now I am in our uh, store in our bakery area in the washroom and I'm going to show you guys our utility room here. This is where my uh, I call my germination room. This is where I germinate all of my plants. And these are the tomato plants I sowed, what was it, a week ago about. I did that video on how to sow tomato seeds. I got the grow lights right here. I got the heat pad. And the reason I, uh, I do grow them in here because I got to control the climate a lot more than inside the greenhouse. I know the greenhouse you can as well, but over here is such a small room. I just put a small space heater, electric heater, and it warms up and it keeps the humidity levels right at high. And you guys can tell here, let me show off the lights real quick, these grow lights. And uh, I'm getting some pretty good germination here. These are the red deuce tomato seeds. I do a lot of succession plantings. And as you guys tell, I got, these are pretty, looking pretty good germination. I did a half tray over there of the red dudes and then the Carolina Golds, they aren't doing too good. But, you know, every seed, every batch is different. Every, you know, the guys who breed them, this, the red dudes variety comes out of Europe. So the guys who breed them over there, they have some pretty good germination rates on the red dudes. On the packages, every package that comes in, they say about 98% germination on that last batch that I did, or the last trays that I did that are in the greenhouse there I got about 99% germination on a on a 128 cell tray count I only found one that didn't germinate that's really good good sign for us because you know you buy the seed in the package and you get what you get but actually you pay a little higher price for the seed 
but then you get a good germination. With good germination, that means more plants in the field. More plants in the field equals more money in my pocket. <laughs> and um, that's pretty much it on the tomato update. And if you guys uh, want to stick around for the tomatoes, I'm, the reason I'm doing this channel is to show you guys everything from the winter as a farmer, as a produce grower, as an apple peach orchard. I'm going to show you guys everything from the seed to the final product back in May whenever we do have our uh, ripe tomatoes. And I'm going to keep track of all the numbers. So I'm going to pretty much be like an experiment station, but just for me. And um, it's going to work great. But that's all I have for today. Thanks for watching. You guys are awesome. And um, come back and see us next time. You guys have a good day.